I'll be showing you step by step how to remove the cart icon from your Shopify refresh theme. We're going to be doing so by adding a custom bit of code here, but don't worry, I'll walk through everything with you and it should only take a few minutes. So let's start things from our Shopify dashboard and I'm going to navigate to the left hand side menu here and click on online store. This will be under sales channels and this will open up the theme section automatically. So we can see here the free fresh theme is my current theme for my store. And if we click view your store in the top right here, it's going to show the card icon in the top right as well. So let's go through all the steps to remove it here. I'm going to navigate back to the theme page here. And what I'm going to recommend you do is duplicate the currently published theme and this is going to create an exact backup copy. So if you make any mistakes or accidental mistakes along the way, it becomes super easy to restore an older version of the theme. The way we do that is head to the three dots here for our currently published theme, and there's going to be a duplicate option. So clicking this is going to create a duplication. I have reached the max for your store, but it looks like this one is duplicating. Okay. That's just going to make your life so much easier if you do accidentally remove something or add something that's causing errors on your store. So let's go and edit that code now. So I'm going to click on the three dots again for my currently published theme, head down to edit code, and this is going to open up the theme code editor. Now, if you click into any of these files, it can be pretty intimidating as there's a ton of code here, but we're going to ignore most of this. We're just going to head to the top left here under the filter files. This is going to be a search bar. And we're just going to search for CSS. And if we take a look under assets, there should be a file called base.css. Now there is also a ton of code in this file as it includes most of the styling for our store. Again, ignoring all of this, I'm going to scroll all the way to the bottom here. And I'm going to add a few line breaks just to create some space. I'll also zoom in here so you can see exactly what I'm typing to make it much easier to copy. And now we're going to write just a few lines here. So the first line is going to be period, header, underscore, underscore, icon dash dash cart. I'm going to add a left curly bracket, which should auto complete the right curly bracket there. I'm going to press enter for a line break. And in between these two curly brackets, I'm going to type in visibility. And as I type it, it should let me auto complete that colon, then hidden semicolon, pressing enter again to make a new line. I'm going to type display colon none semicolon. And so if we take a look at the four lines we wrote. It's period header H E A D E R underscore, underscore, icon, dash, dash, cart, left curly bracket on a new line, visibility, colon, hidden, semicolon, and then display, colon, none, semicolon. So just four lines there are going to remove that cart icon. To finalize these changes, I'll click save. This is going to be in the top right here. And let's click on the preview store button at the top of my page. And as I load my home page, I can see something has disappeared and that's the cart icon no longer appearing here in my header navigation. And that's exactly what we're looking to do. And overall that worked extremely nicely. If you've made any sales on Shopify, you know how hard it is to keep track of how much money your store has actually made. That's where our sponsor profit calc comes in the one click profit calculator available for your Shopify store. All you have to do is select the date range you're looking for to get real time calculations so you can see how profitable your Shopify store really is. It's going to give you tons of details, analytics and breakdowns so you can truly understand your store's performance so you can start making smarter business decisions. It's going to save you hours and hours of time so you don't have to go and use spreadsheets that you're going to update once a month. Profit Calc is going to enable you to stay on top of your store and you can get started with a 15 day free trial so you can test drive everything for yourself. You can find it in the Shopify app store by searching profit calc and looking for this logo in the top left. There's also a link in the description below to access that Shopify app listing directly. So make sure you check that out and start truly understanding your store's performance. So this is going to conclude the video on how to remove the cart icon from your Shopify refresh theme. If this video helped at all, I would love it so much if you smash that like and subscribe button below. If you have any questions, leave a comment, but thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.